Hello viewers, hello listeners, hello everyone. Thank you once again for joining me on DMAPS TV. Please don't forget to subscribe if you are coming here for the first time. If you're regular, just to the usual. Please like and comment and also share our video so that others may just see what we do. Because what we do is we give you current affairs in real time. So yes, about a while ago, Oppo Chimono posted that he was selling his JCPT home. His three-bedroom JCPT house was up for grabs and a lot of Zimbabweans a lot of spectators were quick to conclude on the why he had made the decision to sell the house. Others thought that Opo Chingono was probably relocating to a certain country in search of greener pastures. Others were quick also to think that Opo Chingono had hit a bargain from his friends in America as they allude and others were also quick to even ascertain that he has gone broke and he was actually selling off some of his properties in preparation to locate to his home area in Murewa. But just yesterday, Opo Chungono was back to the people to explain on the why he had made the decision to sell his GCPT house. So he commented and he posted with these beautiful pictures of this exquisite home and he said that this is my new home. This is the home that I'll be moving to since I have given up on the first one that we all knew that used to house even the likes of Anashaba. And now he posted this house and ladies and gentlemen, I say this is living large. This is a good, a very good, a very beautiful house and Opo Chingono seems to have uh, the best taste in terms of choosing I was just checking even the property. You can see that this house comes as fully finished and it is a dream house for many, if not all Zimbabweans. I can say for many Zimbabweans, well, some even have better houses, but for the generality of Zimbabweans, for the greater percentage of Zimbabweans, they, could, they can only dream to have such a house. I think to some, it's like if you live in that house, it's like a heaven on earth kind of house. And you can see that even the quality of the interior and also the quality of the, all the functions, it is a very beautiful house. And we just say to Mukoma, Opo Chingono, congratulations on your recent acquisition. And thank you also for keeping on sharing to the youth on how they can acquire or can they can amaze such wealth to acquire such properties hey, i have seen your post on financial literacy i have seen your post even on working and we of course yes we are not sure how you can finance those big uh, houses those big projects but that is not for us to even think about and your sources of income should never be publicized for any reason and we just upload the Opo Chingono that we know that is very financial illiterate of course having uh, worked abroad for quite a time that is also into farming we have seen how you do goat rearing a goat a rare breed that we have and we have not seen how we have got a text and just for everything and now it is manifesting in this very beautiful and noble house that you have that is like heaven on earth and it's perfect the interiors the cupboards the swimming pools the everything is just top notch and i think i should just keep on saying to you mukoma opo chingono congratulations on this feat this is quite a beautiful a very 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 beautiful house and it is only but a dream to many people especially in my home country the lovely country of zimbabwe and i think it's a double story as we can see from this view it seems to be a double story and even from the other parts of the house that we can show we can see some stairs to the upper part of the house so it's actually a mansion and this is a good fit ladies and gentlemen this is all what we can wish for and what we also have to work towards achieving just imagine living in that iconic house that she's got absolutely everything good in it